the net is the town square. And your hope is that the people in it, your faith when you lead popular movements, is that the people in it, given access to it, will bend the arc towards justice. The internet is awesome. It's the closest thing we've ever had to like a, a true meritocracy. I mean, it, it really is actually like the real free market. Because good ideas trump bad ideas. All it needs is rules to keep a level playing. We need to have open systems, open platforms uh, that encourage innovation. If you control somebody's water, maybe you can poison it, but, but you probably wouldn't get away with, with doing that. If you control somebody's access to the internet, then you start to control what they can read. So that becomes very quickly what they believe. It's got to be equally seen as a part of our community and democracy's infrastructure that's got to be accessible to all people on the same terms without giving preferences or monopolies to certain companies, just like what we understood the highways and the roads and the, and the telephone line. We must recognize that every element of social justice now, education, health, political participation, economic opportunity, and countless other things, is now dependent on harnessing digital technology for social good and ensuring that everybody, in particular marginalized populations, in particular poor people, rural people, elderly people, disabled people, have access to that technology. Giving us a future we share instead of one we kill each other over is the central mission of technology for social change.